Men, and I use the term loosely today, because I'm going to bitch like your old lady at the wrong time of the month. I got a speedometer cable over here I bought from V-Twin. It was, of course, made in Taiwan. Uh, you know, I don't like buying stuff made in a foreign country. I'd rather buy stuff made in the United States. Sometimes you got no choice. And, uh, you know, this is one of those cases. Anyway, I bought the speedometer cable for a guy's uh, bike I'm working on. Uh, it came with two ferrules. Uh, one is metric, one is SA, depending on which kind of speedometer you got. The way these things are supposed to work is like this. This is the bottom end of the cable. It's got threads on it. Screws into the drive on the front wheel. You're supposed to be able to take the nut before you install it on the bike. Install the nut over the bottom ferrule. Slide it up the cable. When it gets up to the top by the speedometer, this flange over here is supposed to catch the inside lip of the nut. You're supposed to be able to screw this on the bottom of the speedometer and tighten it up. Look what happens. <laughs> what the fuck? What kind of stupid fuck engineer, manufacturing company, what the fuck are they thinking? How did they figure that this was going to fucking work? Here's the metric one. You think using their own native units of measurement, the millimeter, you think they'd be able to get it right. Look at the metric one. What the fuck? How fucking stupid do you have to be to design a part and have the attaching pieces be the wrong size out of the box? This wasn't mix and matched. This is how it came out of the fucking package. You know, this was not a particularly expensive thing. I think it was less than 10 bucks, but nonetheless, for 10 bucks, you want it to be at least basically functional. Right now, essentially, I bought a piece of garbage for $10. It's not functional. Realistically, it could go in the trash. It doesn't work. Bad from stock. You know, I'm sure V-Twin will take this thing back. I'm sure they'll give me my money back. They're pretty good about that. I am one of their distributors. I buy a lot of shit from these guys. I work on a lot of bikes. A lot of engines, do restoration, do custom work, and V-Twin is the source for a lot of stuff. I suspect most, if not all of their shit, is made in a foreign country. Like I say, sometimes you got no choice. I will not use made in Taiwanese shit inside of an engine. This external hanging down stuff where, you, you know, it's kind of a dime a dozen, you can place it at will, I have less of a problem with. But critical engine parts, I won't use them. But what the fuck, this is just irritates the shit out of me. I'm at a loss. Anyway, thanks for listening. I am out of here.